Hello guys, another video from my car as every Saturday and today I had a thought from two different tweets. I'm really active on Twitter these days as last few years I guess. So I've noticed and I've retweeted two tweets which I will link both in the description below. Those are about similar topics but I gathered them and collected into one thought which I want to share in this video. It's about writing code not for yourself. The first tweet is about that current development, current coding is mostly about trying to tie two APIs together, which are both undocumented, maybe unfinished, maybe unclear, and you're creating your third API from those two together. So it seems like not writing code these days is the most important, but using the API, external API, usually by someone else, like Laravel packages, for example, and it may be undocumented, it may be unclear and stuff like that. And another tweet was about senior developers or mostly about experience of developers because sometimes it feels like over experience, like a lot of experience may cause trouble for the teammates because experienced people sometimes write too complicated code. They dive into their own head, into complex design patterns, into over engineering, into trying to use all the possible best practices for whatever comes in the future, so in terms of architecture, which may be good, but quite often it confuses teammates, confuses junior and mid devs who need to spend time to even understand that code. And those both tweets, both thoughts led to me thinking, who are we writing code for? And I thought quite often we are writing code for ourselves. So imagine you have a task to finish something and you're focusing on the task with the thought to deliver the task to your manager, to your business owner. So they would launch a feature for the startup and they would potentially earn money. So it's you versus the task or versus the problem and you deliver to the manager, deliver to the business and then you get paid. And if in your task description, you don't have the requirement to expose the API, to document it, to provide the code for someone else, for some other developer to reuse, you often don't think about other developers at that point because you are in a hurry to finish the feature. You are on your own. You don't need external help and you don't think about others in general. That's a human nature and that's kind of okay. But if you think long term and you should think long term, at least somewhat, you should at least think about who would use this code in the future. It may be small amount of extra time. Just add some comments maybe choose more appropriate naming for features and classes and functions and variables. Document something that needs to be documented. So go that extra mile, go that extra five to 10% writing that kind of letter to your future self. It may be yourself actually, but more often it's your teammates or future teammates, future people who would work on that project, future developers who would consume that API potentially. If you think about them, that's what makes you more senior developer, not in terms of writing code, but more thinking about other developers. So that's the random thought for today, for this week from my car. Just think about others in general while coding and not only them. That's it for this time and see you guys in other videos.